Um, next year, I am not listening to no music in the car. My hair, it looks so freaking cute. So messy in here. I never showed y'all my apartment. See, found a vision board. I'm about to go and print them. Stay tuned for my vision board party. <laughs> Hey guys, it's your girl Saria Rain. If you're new to my channel, welcome. If you're not, welcome. Back. So, as you see from the title, this is going to be me preparing for the new year to come, 2023. And I'm doing it all tomorrow, but tonight I have a special guest here. Aloha, yes. But yeah, so we, that's all of this dirtiness is going to be changed up in this video. But she got me a Christmas gift, so I'm about to open it on camera real I'm fast. So <laughs> What? Why are you acting nervous? You acting more nervous than me. It says to Saria from Neek. Are these us? Are these are these like spring boots? This is cute. guys it's the next morning and it is 6 15 so next year i do want to do something for too much straight we are practicing it now so that when the time comes it's not like a big leap so y'all know how that goes it's hard to actually commit to something so it's not a little bit earlier before your deadline and yeah so i will show you guys what the routine is today We're up before seven yay and i'm about to take hazel out Still dark outside, you guys. And this is me preparing for the year. And I was like, why not? I wasn't going to vlog because this is like personal. I wasn't going to vlog until later, but that's my thing. Like, yet lately with YouTube, I haven't been making it personal. It's like more so. If I do it, I do it. So, here is in here. It is literally dark. Yeah, so first step of my soon to be morning routine is taking out the doggy. Come guys so happy new year i hope you guys have a wonderful 2023 and be very intentional about your year and that is what i'm currently doing i have made myself journal gratitude and bible study every single morning regardless just to start my day in a great way building new habits is the best way to change without change there is no growth so if you all want to grow in this next year you need to change in some way for 60 days straight, I'm cutting out a lot of bad things that I do. We're well, not really bad, but distracting things and trying to focus on my mental clarity. And then that will also lead me to focusing on my goals. Everything in your life, elevate. I want everyone to have a great year this year slash next year because 2022 taught a lot to everybody, just as every other year does. And you're going to learn more in 2023. So just be ready for the journey don't think it's going to be easy but be very intentional about your year and what you are doing and where you spend your time journaling and any recap at the end of the day that is what my journal is then i'll read the bible do bible study but right now i am in my office and i do have to clean up but i want to get something done at least one thing done before i go ahead and clean up i'm probably start cleaning up at like nine but you guys i am probably going to start wearing wigs again i don't really know if i want to wear wigs again but i definitely want to get back into sponsors so either or either i'm gonna be wearing wigs again. well i'm getting a wig today but like for the new year I may get wigs or I may get like taping sewing stuff like that while my leave out is out because it's gonna be warm i mean cold so it shouldn't be going up if you made it this far and you're not new comment down below her i have my main three the main three things 
things you have to do during the day. So what I usually do is I write my whole to-do list. I filled it all out. My whole to-do list. And out of this to-do list, pick the main three. The main three things that if you finish them three things, you are good. And I'm going to do those today. I'm going to try to do those within the next hour and a half. So that I can go ahead and start cleaning up. And I'm going to show y'all my apartment because it is really like treacherous in this bitch. It's terrible. It is so terrible. I don't even know how to explain terrible. <laughs> I have a to-do list in my notes. And let me show y'all how much stuff be on my to-do list my, my to-do list is long i can't show y'all because it actually has things on it but it's long if i had dark mode on you'll be able to see it okay this is the check stuff check stuff check stuff check stuff check stuff check stuff uncheck stuff so i be doing stuff and then i usually clear my checks off but this is how i really like keeping my like i have to go to Wells fargo on thursday 9 30 i just put that on there because that's how i remember and I, yeah let me do my work. All right, lovely peoples. I am finished and I am about to go ahead and brush my teeth and wash my face so that I can start with the day. Yeah. She replies, so we're gonna get our hair done. We're gonna get our hair done. We're gonna get our hair done. Yeah. all right you guys so i am heading to my hair appointment it is 40 minutes away but also for my um next year i am not listening to no music in the car by choice now if i'm with somebody and they're listening to music then but i shouldn't really be with that many people if it's not uh productive so yeah i'm gonna see how this goes for me like i want to make sure that i'm like calm with it and not odin hey you guys so damn my camera battery is about to die but i am at the oh. where's my camera battery i put it in my purse I was feeling you, that nigga a munch Nigga either he ate it for lunch Bitch on my body, I get what I want like You thought I was feeling you, that nigga a munch Nigga either he ate it for lunch Bitch on my body, I get what I want like Bitch stay mad, let's keep it a beam When it be mad, I be on the scene Ask too fat, can't fit in a jean Use my stitch, but it's not with a steam I got that ready, I'm keeping it clean Working with niggas that's toting a beam Saying you love me, but what do you mean? Yes, fucking ain't like that I'm mean Baddest bitch out, you shitting me If you ain't a body, can't sit with me I swear that these bitches my mini me. He wanna sex, niggas be dreaming I'm from the ex, niggas be scheming I'm on their necks, niggas not breathing Alright y'all So, back in the car, this is my hair It looks so freaking cute, period Her ad will be on the screen And I'm about to head over To get my nails done I'm gonna get food actually first. I'm about to go to Chick-fil-A. And then I'm gonna go to get my nails done. I might go somewhere over here because over here looks pretty like. It looks real cute though. This camera is so fucking stupid. It was on that whole time. I, I got it, you guys. But I'm about to charge my camera battery so that when I am getting my nails did, it doesn't just abruptly, you know, cut off on this. So. But do you guys, so I have a question. Please comment it down below. So, do you guys like when I talk? like about anything in the video or do y'all like it better when i have them shorter well when i'm not talking as like much or showing y'all just random shit because right now i'm opening up mail i came to my business mailbox and i have some business credit cards in here so it's just like hey i want my vlog to be a long vlog but then again i don't want it to be long of bullshit so y'all let me know Y'all, this shit say, it says sign where requested and return this letter to us to us within 14 days of the date of this letter. 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. It was December 22nd. Six days ago. So let's go ahead and get into my nails. Okay, I'm at Walgreens because I ordered some ashwagandha. 
and some other pills, some supplements. Cause you know, for the new year, I want to just be on track. But they, they haven't came in three days. So I'm just going to look here. Let's see. Look, some right here. I said the Kylie brand is good. These gummies and their gummies. So I might get these. Yeah, I got the pills, y'all. Hi. Can I get a soap off? And, um, yeah. Hey y'all, I'm home now. It is so messy in here. I never showed y'all my apartment, but it's real messy. And this was supposed to be the next thing that I do, but it is already 10 o'clock, y'all. It's already 10 o'clock. I did not want to drag this video out from tomorrow because tomorrow I have a lot to do. But I do want to at least straighten up to the point where it's not shit everywhere. Like, seriously, this is ridiculous. So, y'all don't even want to see that room, bitch. And don't ask me how. I don't know how. It reflects my mental state. Hey, it reflects my mental state. So, take that how you want to <coughs> take that how you want to take it. But your girl is like trying, like, mm -mm, honey. But what I'm going to do. And I'm gonna try to send it to my editor now. Oh, give, me, give me a second. <laughs> Every second, every minute, man, I swear that she can get it. Say if you a bad bitch, put your hands up high, hands up high. Hands up high, tell them dim the lights down right now. Put me in the mood. I'm talking about dark room perfume. Go, go. I recognize your fragrance. Hold up, you ain't never gotta say shit. Uh, and I know you taste this a little bit. Mmm, high maintenance. Uh, everybody else basic. You live life on an everyday basis with poetic justice. Poetic justice. I told you that a flower bloom in the dark room, would you trust it? I mean, I write poems in these songs, dedicated to you when You're in the mood for empathy, it's blood in my pen Better yet with your friends and him I really wanna know you all, I really wanna show you off Fuck that, hold up, plenty of champagne Cold nights when you curse this name You called up your girlfriends and your girl in that little bitty range I heard that she wanna go and party she wanna go and party, nigga don't approach her with that Atari Nigga that ain't good game, homie, sorry They say conversation, rule a nation I can tell, but I could never write my wrongs Lest I write it down for real, P.S. I really hope you play this Cause old girl, you test my patience With all these seductive photographs And all these one-off vacations you've been taking Clearly a lot for me to take in It don't make sense, young East African girl Too busy fucking with your other man I was trying to put you on game Put you on a plane, taking your mama to the motherland I could do it, maybe one day When you figure out you're gonna need someone When you figure out it's all right here in the city And you don't run from where we come from That sound like poetic justice Poetic justice you were so new to this life, but goddamn, you got adjusted. I mean, I write poems in these songs dedicated to the fun sex. Your natural hair and your soft skin and your big ass and that sundress. Ooh, good God, what you doing that walk for? When I see that thing move, I just wish we would fight less and we would talk more. Okay, you guys, so I'm done straightening up. I have not actually cleaned. Well, I kind of cleaned my kitchen, but I didn't scoop them up or nothing. And in my bathroom, I didn't clean my tub out or my counter down. I haven't vacuumed. But y'all didn't see my closet before, y'all. But I actually finally straightened my closet up. You couldn't even see the flow, y'all. I put all the clothes up. So that is progress for me. And it is only 7 o'clock. So I think I did that in like two hours. And so, yeah, this is dirty gloves right here. But we have all of the Christmas stuff set up well, over there. And then I gotta take the tree down. I gotta take that off too. But everything else is off the walls. Returning that to Macy's. And here's my Bible and my journal and that I'm gonna do I do every morning. So don't leave that. I took the city off because I was hot, but yeah. And that's going in my trunk. Gotta take that to the but I could go in my washing machine. I don't know. The taser cage, it just be the it just be the And yeah, look at my room, you guys. This is trash too, I don't want that. But yeah, this is, hold on, got a vacuum. 
so finished with this and i also want to go ahead and make a vision board tonight i'm gonna sit down and make a vision board tonight not digital i'm gonna make an actual physical one a visual one at my vision board party that y'all should be at cough the fuck cough it's virtual boy well, it was virtual so yeah i will see you guys at the store probably because i'm gonna go get the board and the supplies today I need to clean up but i don't even have cleaning supplies for real i don't have the spray that i usually use so i can't really clean yet i can clean my tub but like counters and stuff i can't but like that's like my routine i, I gotta do it all so i don't know if i'm gonna go to the store come back and then clean or what but yeah all right, y'all, I'm at Walmart. I'm trying to think if I want to do a vision book or a vision board. I don't know. But the book, I will never open it, so I feel like that's a waste of time. I'm going to look for a board. These are big. I better go with a small one because I don't want nothing too, too, too large. Mini poster board. Let me get this and do small vision boards because I usually have some big, big ones. How many come in this 12 pack? Because I would get this, but y'all know that's, that's big, so. Mm -mm. And I need markers, anything that's like cute or whatever. But I'm on the phone, <clears throat> so let me keep looking, and then I'm gonna show you guys my buggy before I check out. Oh, my camera battery about to die. I hate these stupid ass cameras. <laughs> All right, home sweet home. Let me show you guys what I got. I got Popeyes too, but here is this weekly thing that I got so that I could see it to know like. What I have to do to, for days. Because I bought this just because it's just a weekly planner. But I like didn't know exactly what I was going to do with it. Because y'all know I have my planner. My daily notepad. But I don't have a planner for day to day things. So this is going to be my day to day things and my business things. They're just in my notes. So like if I have a photo shoot. Well no that's influencing. If I have to check emails. Or I have to do some business wise. It's going to go on this weekly planner. And I'm also going to put... I'm also going to put, oh, if I have a place to go, I have an appointment. I be like forgetting I be having appointments because they're in my notes. So I will put these on the board and read it every single morning, like just throughout the day. I'm not even going to put it somewhere where I can see it at and it's like not like just random. So I might put it like right here. I a spot by my AC. If I could just see it. Yeah, this is good. Every single day so that I could see what I have to do. And then I don't know what people do down here, but I might write like my scriptures of the day or of the week or I'm going to put like probably a mission statement for my week. Like this week I'm going to, this week is going to be called um, Clarity, Clarity Week or a week of clarity. So this whole week is all about clarity and clearing and being clear and transparent, understanding, like stuff like that. And then this can be like to-do list or something. I don't know what I'm gonna do with it completely, but I did go ahead and buy this from the store. So this is gonna go right there up on the wall. I'm gonna be just using it ASAP, no Rocky. But I just got these poster boards, they're flimsy and it comes in a pack of 12. I got some dry erase markers for this so I can make it colorful. I got some shea butter. For my burns, this ain't for like stretch marks and stuff, but girl, hey, okay, for me. Then I got some scissors. You know, I have scissors, but you know, scissors be getting dull. And I got some glue, and then obviously I have a printer, so everything else is gonna be up to the printer. I don't like the magazine route, so we're not gonna do the magazine route. We're gonna do paper route. So let's go ahead and get into our vision board. I'm about to take my supplements for tonight. I just got these in the mail. It's tea. It's actually tea. It's spearmint tea. But I usually drink it, but I don't like the taste, and this smells just like it so i'm just gonna start taking the capsule version oh so we're gonna see like how it works out for me oh wow but yeah let's go ahead and get into it put your back into it y'all all right y'all i just spent the last forever um making my pictures can y'all see from the vision board i'm about to go and print them right now so i could i could print from my ipad i, I believe so i think you just Press this and then, cause I'm connected to the Wi-Fi, so print. It's low on ink. Did I not just get new ink? We're gonna still do it. We're gonna roll with it. I'm supposed to make the same vision board three times, but I might just make that motherfucker one time. Cause I'm getting sleepy. I just getting sleepy. I just getting sleepy. <laughs> but I just printed my second one and I'm about to print my third one. And we're really gonna get into actually like doing it. I wanna listen to some tunes. Love me, 
Alright you guys, so I have finished my physical vision board. Um, so that is going to be the end of today's video. I will see you all in the next video. Make sure you guys stay tuned for my vision board party so that you can be invited and so that we can do it virtually because I'm going to do it way more in depth on there because that's what I want to do. So yeah. Happy New Year to you all. I know it's coming up. You probably are watching it after. Happy New Year to you. And I hope that you join my vision board party so that you can make your next year the best year that you possibly can. Because it's just more than just writing down your goals. It's more to it than that. That people don't understand. So let's crush our goals this year. Let's be disciplined this year. Let's learn this year. All of that. Let's earn this year. Period. You need to master some skills, Pookie, so that we can make some cleaning. Okay, okay, it's deeper than that. It's deeper than the drill of the money to say the boys. The boys, the boys, the boys. As far, comment down below 2023. Um, I don't know who really is gonna get this far in the video, but if you did, thank you. And that's why you need to comment so that I can see how rare you are. I like to see repetitive names. So if you don't really comment like that, you should comment more. So that, that I can know you, you know what I'm saying? Like, I have some names in my head I see all the time that I know who's watching, you know? It's nice to see that, and I want to talk back to y'all. But, yeah, I want to come in here and talk a little bit more about my monk mode, what I am doing next year. Because I don't think I really talked about it for real. So, my 60-day reset is what I'm calling it. You could do it every day. I say a minimum of 30, which is kind of low, but 60 is kind of in the middle, you know. Some people do, like, three months. Three months is, like, max. Like, that's crazy. But no drinking and smoking, and I'm going to explain why. So, no drinking and smoking because when you are drinking and you're smoking, you are under the influence, meaning it triggers your brain. The reason you feel that way is because of your brain. So, if you're not in a sober state of mind, you can't make sober decisions, stuff like that. Even if you feel more creative when you're high or drunk or whatever, no. Be sober because that is you. Be you to reach where you want to be, not where you want to be high. You know what I'm saying? It's a privilege. It's like a luxury, which is terrible in all aspects, but... So no drinking or smoking. Just to focus, waking up by 7 a.m. every single day, even on the weekends. Probably on the weekends it might be like 8, but still early. Get Keep it going. Because after like three days, I've been doing it for three days. Well, four days now, but th or four or five days. But the first three days, I had built the habit of waking up early. Like it became something normal. And when you wake up early, you get a lot of stuff done. And by the time you're done with everything, it's, it's still 9 o'clock, 8 o'clock. It's like, wow, I just woke up. I mean, I've been woke up, and it's already the time that I was going to wake up on regular. So, waking up by 7 and making sure that you're planning your days the night before. Like, if you have work, obviously, then you wake up for work. You still need to wake up even if you have work later in the day, just so you can be up and running a day. It really just depends on what type of job you work, if you work a job. Next, I'm going to use my planner daily. You guys know I do have my hair planner, which is my influencer planner. And that's how it keeps me on track. I also have a weekly planner out into my living room, which oh, y'all saw it, which is for like personal things. If I have an appointment to do, if I'm going to just go ahead and clean up, like stuff that doesn't go into an influencer planner is out there. Next, I'm going to go to the gym consistently. So I'm going to start tonight. Okay, I might have to start tomorrow, which is the first. But going consistently, I'm not trying to go every single day yet. So I will want that eventually. But at first, I'm going to do like every two days because it's right across the street. I'm going to go to the one at my apartment. So when I find time to do so, that is what I am going to do. Journal Gratitude Bible Study Daily. You already saw that. But I want to get closer to God. Reading his word is the way to get closer. Not just prayer, which prayer gets you close. But knowing and understanding what happened and where he's coming from where Jesus came from, then you understand more and you abide more and you obey more and you understand more. Because usually when you don't know about the Bible, people tend to try to run away from it. Everything that you do isn't, okay, it's bad, it's sin, yes, 
but everything is forgiven. So if you understand what positions to not put yourself in to to le- lessen the chance of your flesh sinning, then it's good. You know, it's okay to mess up, but some people don't understand that. So when they mess up, they beat themselves completely up about it. So gratitude is to be thankful. Journal is just to get it off my mind. Learn to master marketing and selling, which is my job. Y'all know I have a business. In order to sell anything, even YouTube, selling and marketing, it's just how you get somebody to do something, okay? That's it. That's all. I'm going to master that. Content days two times a week. So starting next week, I do want to take pictures at least twice a week to get content out whether that's reels whatever content two times a week supplements daily supplements are very very great if you lack deficiency in certain things such as vitamin c vitamin d whatever i am taking ashwagandha y'all can see to lower my cortisol levels and just have me more leveled out less stressed better focus better sleep so yeah cook three times a week i have a hello fresh subscription so i'm going to be cooking three times a week i got three meals a week so that is cooking three times a week no rap music in the car your soul your ears are the way to your soul i believe is the saying so if you're listening to rah rah kill shit shit shot shoot cheater cheater sex this sex that then you're gonna rob, rob, shooter, shooter, sex, that, sex, that, and think stuff like that is okay because that's what you feed your soul. So if you feed your soul learning or sermons or uh, whatever, then that is what your outcome in your life will be. And I'm telling you, try it. You're gonna have to wait. Next, you have upload on Serena's Wealth three times a week because I want to get back in the group of Serena's Wealth so that I can show you guys my knowledge and let my knowledge out and stuff like that. I want to get consistent on that channel. YouTube for educational purposes only. After tomorrow, I'm not watching any entertainment YouTube. Like, it is literally going to be that. And then it's no cursing, okay? So that is what I'm doing, and I hope that you guys can join me or make up your own rules, and that is going to be the end of today's video. Bye!